Hello and welcome to my channel Among in Cloud. I am Yashwant and I'm thrilled to have you here. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a video. And don't forget to leave a comment to let me know what you think. Thank you for joining me on this journey and I can't wait to share more with you. Let's get started. In this video, let's talk about what is multi-tenancy or multi-tenancy. So people pronounce multi and multi. So you can go with whatever you want, right? So why am I discussing this? Because this is needed in cloud computing. So the base of your cloud providers, the concept is multi-tenancy, right? So let's break down what is multi-tenancy in this video. So multi-tenancy is a concept in cloud computing that allows multiple customers or tenants to use or to share a single instance of a cloud service or application while keeping their data and applications isolated and secure from each other. Here's an example. I've uh, you know given an example also on how exactly multi-tenant works in cloud computing. Okay. Let's say consider uh, consider a cloud-based software as a service, a SaaS application that provides project management tools to its customers. Okay, let's consider Azure DevOps as a service. Okay, so the application is hosted on a cloud provider's infrastructure and allows multiple customers to access the same application while keeping their data and projects isolated and secure. Okay, so that is the basic idea here. In multi-tenant environment, each customer's data and projects are stored in separate partition or a logical container within the application's database. Each customer can access their data and projects through the same user interface, but their data is kept in a separate, it, it is kept separate from the other customers. The cloud provider manages the infrastructure including servers storage and network resources that are shared by all the tenants of the application the provider must ensure that each tenant's data and projects are isolated and secured from other tenants and that each tenant has sufficient resources and performance to meet their needs so this multi-tenant approach allows the cloud provider to serve many customers using a single instance of the application, reducing the cost and increasing the efficiency. At the same time, it allows customers to access the same tools and resources as other tenants at a lower cost while keeping their data and projects secure and private. Right. So that's all about multi-tenancy. I hope you're liking the content that I'm creating. If you're liking it, please consider subscribing and share it among your friends. Thank you and I will see you in the next one.